Dennis, you're unusual. You ride and train. Yeah, a lot of people say that to me. Um, what, what, what possessed you to go training? Um, I suppose from from a young age, um, I've always been keeping one or two of my own. And between the pony racing and then on the track and the point to pointers, um, up along, um, I've always done kept one or two of my own. And it was from there, I had a great buzz out of bringing along a young horse or, or, or putting a bit of form on one. So. Grew from there, I probably want to, all I was going to do with them. Does it help riding knowing the horses so well? Definitely, yeah, it's def definitely a, a huge help. Um, I feed every horse in the morning. Um, it just it gives me a great insight. I, I think it tells you a lot. You see a little bit of feed there, and it's not usually there. There's something up, so you, you look further into it. And I know then when I go out in the gallops, no more. Um, ride them in a race. Um, I learn a lot, and 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 whereas. I suppose I have come into a lot of trainers over the years and said, geez, if I had a known, I might have just had a known, or I might have just hung on, or I might have just won, you know, but next day. So I suppose I don't, well, I do still have them problems. I still, I still have some here. It takes me a good few runs to figure them out. So probably got some bread into the game. It's probably bread to be a farmer. But um, Charlie Swan was more or less next door, um, just down the road. and. Uh, at the time, he was champion jockey, and he was year after year. I suppose that was a big, big encouragement on, on me getting into it. And um, he he then built a riding school at the time. Started a bit of pony racing, had a bit of success there. And I think it was after doing my junior shirt, and I had it in my head that I wasn't going back to school. In the end up, Charlie got me a job with Michael Halford, um, which benefited was riding and what I learned there was you know endless. Had a good winner for Charlie at a, at a Galway festival what half a dozen years ago. Yeah um, on, the, on the other hand um, one of JP's um, he um, he was a good, good kickstart to my career as well um, could have been claiming five or seven at the time and that got the ball rolling yeah. And Dennis Hogan the trainer I mean obviously you want the big wins you want the wins at the big meetings the big horses as well and you were in the winners enclosure at, at the festival Galway festival last summer yeah we, we, we had a superb Galway um, we would have been happy with a winner um, but to get a, a premier handicap and, and, and a big winner on the Monday night it's a huge boost yeah. Come to the final flight, Kellel Chan in the lead, being chased by Maxim Gorky on the far side. Kellel Chan is going to make all the running and uh, win this under top weight. Kellel Chan wins it cosily. It was like a, I, I've ridden a good few winners, but I, my heart was going 110 miles an hour there. I've only had two or three winners where I've been on the ground. Um, it's very different. Yeah. Um, you get a great kick out of training and riding them, but I got some kick out of that. Dennis, big, big handicap coming up this Saturday. What about it? Obviously, it would be your biggest success. Inishman, he's the favourite. He is, he is, um, they've put him in a favourite. Like, um, look at it, it, it is a big ask. Um, you need a lot of luck. 30 on our handicap around Leopardstown. Um, there's not much room for error, you know. Um, so, with a, with a good round, um, with a good round of jumping and, and, and a bit of luck, hopefully, we can be involved, you know. And you're going to ride him and you train him. What are your feelings going to be on Saturday? I sure. Look at um, there's people saying to me, Jesus, you know, is, you know, I feel the pressure or whatever with training and riding. But okay, there, there is a bit of pressure there, and if there was some pressure, you know, there'd be no fun in it. So um, we can only do our best, and I'm looking forward to it. And, and, and he has a nice weight in his back, so hopefully.